In this video I'm going to show you how to mirror an animation. So I have this guy swinging uh, with his right arm. Uh, so you can bake to skeleton. Then go in your character properties. So double click that character in the navigator or uh, select it and go to properties. Then you want to go to modifiers. And here you have mirror animation. You can select that and that mirroring is only going to apply when you bake back to uh, your control rig. So the best is for you to duplicate that take first. Call that mirror. I'm going to bake to the control rig. I don't know why it does that, but it always mirrors across the X and Y plane instead of uh, the Z and Y plane, which is pretty what you want. So. That means you have to uh, re-rotate re your, your clip manually, unfortunately. So you can do it in the story mode. Insert take, take your, your clip and uh, rotate 180 degrees with the snapping. So I have snapping on 45 degrees. Unfortunately, when you do that, it offsets your root bone because uh, the transform of the story clip is relative to the pelvis and the pelvis is not exactly centered on top of the root bone controller in my uh, main pose so so it's a bit annoying because uh, it means you need to center your, your clip then select your root look at those values 8.14 0.82 so that's going to be random based on your, on your idle pose then um, like subtract this from your story clip now my root is centered so that's not the best solution so if I come back to the story mode I can just take my root select all my keys rotate my root 180 degrees in full body and then say move keys so now I flip my entire clip the other way around. My root bone is now also facing the other way around, but I can do the exact same operation just in selection mode. Move keys. And now my root is back uh, moving forward. So I have mirrored my animation and the root is properly aligned. 